grown man business. All right, we got another episode of Red Ghost Sports Talk. I'm your host, Red Ghost. All right, um, some more NBA talk, man. We got some good news. We got some bad news, too. Uh, before I get the scores of tonight's games, I'm going to go ahead and talk about the L.A. Clippers. Um, you know, Doc Rivers my boy, man. Um, I don't like this choice right here, this decision, though. Uh, they traded um, Josh Smith back. I'm back. That's crazy. Back to the Rockets. Back to the Houston Rockets. I like I like Josh Smith, man. He was a great player out here in, uh, in Atlanta with the Hawks. I think he was just with some bad teams early on in his career. You know, he won a slam dunk contest at one time. Um, he can play about two or three positions, man. He been working on his three pot, his three shot, his three point shot over the years since he you know been getting older. He's got a little age on him, but they traded him back to Houston, and Houston really didn't know what to do with him, and that that was the reason why they even traded him to uh to the Clippers, you know. And I wish Doc Rivers would have found a place for him, a system to put him in over there with the Clippers, man. I think he would have been a good. Uh, a good fit, man, especially coming off the bench. You know, give some of his starters uh, a chance to rest. You know, he used to be a starter. He has experience. But he, he's going back to uh, Houston. So, I don't, we're going to see how that go. Houston, they up and down. They fired their head coach early in the season. And um, he just got lost out there, man. He was on the bench, and people forgot he was even in the league, in my opinion. I thought he was be. A, I thought I thought he'd be a good fit with the Clippers, man. I I was pretty sure I knew Doc Rivers would uh, have a place for him and know what to do with him, but obviously not. They traded him back over to to Houston, so it is what it is. But I like Josh Smith, man. He's a good player. All right, let's do let's do some scores tonight, man. Uh, the Jazz they beat the Nets. They just killing my Nets, man. Uh, the Nets just been losing. Almost every night, man. That's uh, that's been pissing me off. But uh, all right, the Jazz beat the Nets one hundred eight to eighty six, and it haven't even been close either. The Clippers they beat the Knicks one sixteen to eighty eight. Knicks been slipping lately, man. They've been real quiet, you know. I've been watching the Bulls, but the Knicks been really slipping. Uh, the Rockets they beat the Bucks one hundred and ninety four. The Hornets they beat the Magic one twenty to one sixteen. And the Celtics, they beat the Bulls 110 to 101. Oh, man. It's just been kind of crazy in the NBA, man. I'm watching right now. It's a game on right now, man. That's uh, Golden State Warriors, this hat right here. And uh, Indianapolis, um, Indiana uh, <laughs> Pacers, excuse me. But, uh, yeah, and, you know, Golden State's doing their thing, so. Those State Warriors is looking real dangerous this year. Um, Spurs been looking good too, but man, the Warriors been on a whole another level. You know, OKC man, the Thunder been playing real good ball right now, man. I'm gonna start. Uh, I'm gonna do some stories on them too, cause they. I've been watching a couple games uh, this week and last week with the Thunder, man, and and Westbrook. It's a beast right there, man. KD doing his thing. He gonna get his regardless, but uh. Yeah, the Thunder, that's another team to watch out for in the West, man. On the East, watch out for the Bulls. Uh, the Heat, watch out for Heat, man. They got some young players over there, and they got some talent. They playing some good, you know, basketball over there. You know, we know uh, Dwayne Wade, you know, he just he getting a little age on him, but he's still playing good. Uh, he show, you know, uh, he's a good spark to the team. He's a good leader, and uh, he's a veteran, man. You know, the guy got three rings, so. But, uh, yeah, some teams to watch out for. The Celtics also. Watch out for them guys, man. All right, well, I'm going to come back with some more NBA talk. I'm going to try to uh, I'm gonna try to hit y'all with some NBA all week long coming up next week, man. I've been kind of slacking on, on, on the basketball, and that's my fault, man. It's just been so much good football going on, and I, I just can't leave basketball alone, man, really. It's it's a lot going on, especially in college. 
Miami Hurricanes are playing some good basketball. They lost the other night to Clemson. I hated that, but uh, college basketball is interesting, man. Michigan State is looking <laughs> – they looking real good this year. It's a lot of good talent, man. LSU, I like that kid over there. But we're going we're gonna to get into it, man, and start getting back into the flow of things. Football season is almost over with. You know, in about, you know, less than a month, you know, three weeks, we'll be in the Super Bowl, so – we're gonna get uh get y'all ready for our basketball talk, baby. Grown man business. <laughs>